Hi, this is Dolan from Benchmark, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to use MicroSurveys Field Genius to take a bearing bearing intersection using the Kogo tool. So, what I'm going to do to begin here is I've I've got Field Genius open, and I've taken two points um, near each other, um, point one and point two here. And what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to head to the plumb bob in the bottom left corner of my screen here. And in that menu, I'm going to want to select Calculations, and then the Traverse slash Intersection option there. And when I click on this for the first time, you're going to see that I have a method that says uh, Traverse, and that's not the method I want to use to do this bearing-bearing intersection. What I want to do is I want to switch it to the third one there that says Method Direction dash Direction. And what I'm going to do now is you can see that I have an option for point one, Direction, point two, and Direction. So I'm going to have to select the two points that I want to intersect and then determine at what heading or bearing I want to uh, have the intersection from the points meet up at. So for point one here, I'm going to select my point one in this case. And then for my direction, I'm going to choose 270 degrees so I get a line that's just to the left of point one. And when I do that, you can see that Field Genius automatically draws just a red line. Um, and then for point two here, I'm going to select my point two in this case. And then my direction, I'm going to choose as zero degrees. That's going to create a red arrow to intersect with my point one arrow directly straight above point two when I'm looking at my screen here. And when that happens, you can now see that the two um, bearings now intersect at a, a green point here. And if I hit my little uh, info button there, I can see all the information about this point. So it's telling me from what points I'm intersecting and the distance from those points. And, and then the position of that new point so I can go find it in the real world with my GPS. So let me just close out of this uh, this window here and then I'm going to hit store solution point and I can actually store this now created point. So you can see here I've got my point ID, I can add a description and then I have the new coordinates for this calculated point and then I'm just going to hit store point and you can see on my map screen here I have a new point three that it was previously where those two bearings intersected. And that's all for today's video. If you have any questions about anything you've seen, or maybe you want to give Field Genius a try or try out any of our Hemisphere GPS, please give us a call at 1-888-286-3204, or you can visit our website at bench-mark.ca.